Today's hashtag daily debate question for at MMA Junkie Radio. Which former UFC champion with a title fight booked at this moment has the best chance to reclaim gold? Frankie Edgar. As you all know, he signed on to fight Max Holloway at UFC 240 on July 27th. Holly Holm, as you all know, she's going to fight uh, Amanda Nunes on July 6th, UFC 239. Stipe Miocic, he just signed on to fight Daniel Cormier, UFC 241 in Anaheim on August 17th. Wow, those are three great champions, but we got to pick someone. Basically, you know what? We're not picking who we think has the best chance to win. We're almost saying this is the champion I think has the biggest chance of choking in the big fight. Mm-hmm. Uh, but anyway, we don't really mean that that way. These are all, these are six great fighters. Who'd you pick us? I'm going with Frankie Edgar. And I'm going to tell you why. Okay. I feel like uh-huh. Frankie Edgar is getting a fighter in Max Holloway that just took one of the biggest beatings he's ever taken in his life. Mm-hmm. To Dustin Poirier? He's getting it right after that. Uh, Frankie is a difficult matchup when you look at how fast he moves, the way he can mix in his takedowns, his striking, he's in and out. He's kind of a nightmare for a guy like Max Holloway. My number two would have been Stipe Miocic. He's going up against one of the goats. Mm -hmm. Rather roll the dice with Frankie. Holly Holm has no chance? She has a chance, but not enough for me to pick. What is Amanda's biggest strengths? Hits hard. She's tough. She doesn't close her eyes. She just comes forward. Right. But she throws hands, right? That's, that's kind right. of her biggest weapons. What was Holly Holm a champion of before she came over to the UFC? Kickboxing. No. Don't do it. We're boxing. Boxing. Don't do it. And she kickboxed her way to a, a few nice big wins, highlight real wins in Legacy. Don't do it. And she's got experience. She's fearless. I'm she warning fought, you. She fought Ronda. She's fought Cyborg. So she's not walking in there scared. She's basically trying to figure out, are my hands going to be better than her? I think she might be more technical than Amanda Nunes. Technical, yeah. But I don't feel like... I feel like she's the type of girl that Amanda can just watch tape on and be prepared for. I think Ronda kind of took that fight. She just really thought she was Ronda. She was going to run through everyone. And I think she caught her by surprise. But in this case, Amanda Nunes has just been prepared for everything. I mean... Put Valentina Shashenko in front of her twice. She's a hell of a striker. And she no, put up uh, with it. Amanda, or, sorry, Valentina gave her good fights, but it was never enough. You know, Amanda Nunez, I still don't think she gets enough credit for that one calf kick she threw at Cyborg. I feel like that's what made Cyborg go a little berserk mm-hmm. sooner than she needed to. That's just something that the American top team really, really pushes. Uh, and I feel like that may be something she can also come into play against uh, Holly Holm. I'm also with you. I think Frankie Edgar is a bad matchup for Max Holloway because of the wrestling and how he's committed to it. And his, once he gets you down, his ground and pound is very solid. There's a lot of fighters where you're like, okay, if he gets him down, now what? Advance his position, look for dominant positions, blah, blah, blah. Frankie Edgar is very comfortable with just beating the shit out of you if he's on top. Plus, you made another good point, and that's Max Holloway is just in a war. So, I don't know. But I'm also with you. I just think Holly Holmes is the second one. Second choice? Yeah. Yeah, and it was pretty close between the two. And Steven Miocic would be my third choice. Because DC, he's as long as he's not too distracted by John, the whole John Jones deal, mm-hmm. he's just vanquished anybody you put in front of him with the exception yeah. of John Jones. I think if we put a gun to your head, you would not give that response. If I put a gun to your head, you're not taking Daniel Cormier over Steven Miocic? If you put a gun to my head, yeah. my first choice is Frankie. Yeah. The next one is Stipe, yeah. and then it's Holly. No, I'm going Frankie, Holly, Stipe. All right. Yeah, but if I put yeah. a gun to your head, I don't think you're saying that. I think you're being cute right now for them. But I think if I put a gun to your head, you're not going to say that. All right, you got me. Yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, my man is a beast. All right. Look, almost 1,000 votes came in, and the voting's going to end in about two minutes, so I think I'm pretty safe to say almost 1,000 votes came in. But this is how it came down, goes. 65% said Stephen Miocic. Damn. That was our number three. That was their number one. 24% said Holly Holm. Only 11% of Junkie Nation thinks that Frankie Edgar has a chance to upset Max Holloway. That's the Daily Debate brought to you by the MMA Junkie Radio Team.